how does coconut oil affect heart disease? And are there some studies out there, some scientific studies out there? One of the big um, factors of confusion with coconut oil is that people think that it promotes heart disease because it's saturated fat right. content. Mm -hmm. Now, as we discussed earlier, the saturated fat in coconut oil is different from the saturated fat in meats or in other vegetable oils. It's a medium chain fatty acid that actually protects against heart disease. And if you go to um, populations around the world that have a high coconut oil consumption, mm -hmm. you find that their heart disease rates are much lower. In fact, those people with the highest coconut oil consumption have the lowest heart disease rates in the world. For example, in Sri Lanka, in 1979, uh, there was a survey that showed that every man, woman, and child in the country mm -hmm. consumed the equivalent of 120 coconuts a year. That's a lot of coconut and a lot of coconut <laughs> oil. But in that year, they had the lowest rate of heart disease in the world. One out of every 100,000 deaths was caused by heart disease. Now compare wow. that to America. At the same yeah. time, uh -huh. you know, nearly half of the deaths were heart-related. And we don't eat hardly any coconut at all. No, we don't. Now, over time, uh, in Sri Lanka, there was, there's this anti-saturated fat campaign throughout the world, you know, uh, right. reduce your saturated fat content. So uh, even, yeah. <laughs> even in Sri Lanka, in the coconut regions, they started to reduce their saturated fat. And so coconut oil came down, and a very interesting thing happened. They re replaced their coconut oil with polyunsaturated vegetable oils and margarines and things. And as coconut oil consumption came down, heart disease went up. Just the opposite of what, you know, they thought would happen. It was that apparent. It was that apparent. In the coconut growing regions of India, the same thing happened. They were told to stop eating coconut oil because it's a saturated fat. Within 10 years, the heart disease rate tripled. And those are scientific studies. Right, these are studies, published studies. Plus you're dealing with people's cultures too. Mm -hmm. And so they were told something that they were eating was unhealthy and then they became unhealthier by changing their diet. Right, and most of the heart disease cases in these coconut growing countries come from the cities where people eat the least amount of coconut oil because they eat the imported oils. Mm -hmm. Now when you go outside the cities into the villages that still rely on coconut oil as their primary source of dietary fat, heart disease is either rare or non-existent. Even, and they've done studies on these people. Mm -hmm. And even the people, the oldest people of the population who live to be nearly 100 years old, who have been eating coconut oil almost every day of their lives, they study these people and they have no evidence of heart disease. They do not have high blood pressure, they have no clogging in the arteries, yet they've been eating coconut oil for nearly 100 years and it has cost them no problem whatsoever. <laughs> Thank you, Bruce.